When it comes to dowsing and dowsing devices, I prefer using L rods. And a lot of times I only use one L rod. The reason for that is I do a lot of work on the earth, on the land, following energies, finding energy centers, doorways and passages through these energy centers. So the L rods allow me to follow them when they change direction, I change direction. This is how I do it. When you practice using L rods, you make a connection between the movement of the L rod and sensations in your physical body. That's very important. When you make that connection, you're on your way to what we call deviceless dowsing, where you don't use any rods or pendulums at all. You just go by that inner feeling that you've learned to trust through the process of dowsing. The dowsing rods that I make are very strong. I make them out of stainless steel. That enables me, when I'm locating energy centers on the land, I can push the L rod into the ground and use it as a marker. I'll have sometimes 12 rods laid out around a property, all stuck into the ground. Some of the simpler versions of L rods, you can't do that because they bend. So I like using my field rods. 